For verily I say unto you, that whosoever shall say unto this mountain, be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, and shall not doubt in his heart. Watch it again. Doubt in his heart. Say it again. Doubt in his heart. So let me tell you how mountains are consolidated. Before a mountain becomes a situation, it first of all becomes a stronghold in your mind. Sometimes the issue is not the mountain you are facing. The issue is the mountain in your heart. The issue is not pastor what I'm going through or what I'm facing. No. What mountain is making me limit God? What mountain is telling me that my prayers are not making sense? What mountain is letting me know that I can be under this anointed atmosphere and things will remain the way they are? What is the mountain in my heart? Somebody call your name and say, Jerry, right now, relocate the mountain. Lift up your right hand and say, my father, Father, my father, I speak into the next 10 years of my life. I take it by force. I redeem the next 10 years, the next 20 years, the next 30 years, the next 40 years, the next 50 years of my life. I announce the lion of the tribe of Judah has prevailed. Let your amen thunder.